guys! So I decided to do an updated vanity video because the last one I did was like seven months ago and my vanity's changed quite a bit since then. So I figured you'd all want to see kind of what it looks like now. So yeah, that's the far away view. It's still the same actual vanity and mirror, just the uh, organization's a little different. So that's my actual vanity. It's from Ikea. It's the Malm series, M-A-L-M. -M. It's discontinued. Um, they have a smaller one now that's not nearly as good, in my opinion, but if you want a smaller version of it, it is available on the IKEA website. Um, the mirror is also Malm. It's discontinued, though, as well. Um, it's all one mirror, and it kind of has these parts that move. So on my actual vanity, I have this box here that has all my lip products, lipsticks and lip glosses, lip glasses. These are all MAC and it's just, I cut the actual packaging so that they just kind of fit in there like that. Um, and then these little brush holders, I made them myself. Um, I went to Michael's and I just got a couple of vases and um, some feather boa stuff and some felt zebra print stuff and I just wrapped it around and glued everything together. Um, I filled it with those little beads that you can get at Michael's as well. And yeah, all my brushes kind of stand up in there. These are all face brushes and then these are all eye brushes. Um, this is for dirty brushes. I just cleaned all these so they're wet and drying. Um, this has Q-tips in it. Very necessary. Um, this is my mirror that I use. It lights up three times. Um, the other side is magnified, which I'll never use. Um, I have a little faced cloth here to spot clean my brushes. The top drawer here is all um, mineralized skin finishes, blushes. Oh my god. Um, blushes, mineralized skin finishes, all MAC. And in the bottom I have all my lip liners, eye liners, um, some jumbo eyeshadow pencils from NYX, and some grease paint sticks and stuff by MAC. All that stuff's in here. Um, this is the latest Lush newspaper thing that I haven't gone through yet. Uh, this is all like face stuff. Fix Plus, um, hand sanitizer, very important. Moisturizer for the face, moisturizer for your hands, um, strobe cream, and this is brush cleaner that I use Encore's homemade brush cleaner recipe. You can just search Encore on YouTube and that'll come up. And Lush Candy Fluff back there in the back. Um, this mirror that I never ever use, but it sits on my vanity. And then, we can open up this drawer here. So I have this, like, little, like, metal organizer things that I picked up at Walmart. These are all my paint pots and chroma lines. This is, like, a variation of lip stuff. Um, a lot of not MAC stuff, but also some MAC limited edition, like my Blooming Lovely and my Va Viva Glam Gaga, some Sephora stuff, just stuff that I ran out of room for, basically. Uh, and this one is all MAC pigment samples, um, some Cryolan pigment. Lots of MAC pigment samples, uh, some Bare Minerals stuff, all the non-MAC stuff here, and pigment samples. Um, this big guy here has all my Benefit blush boxes, my MAC Invisible Set Powder, this stuff's amazing. NARS Laguna Bronzer, and my two NARS blushes, Deep Throat and Orgasm. And then a couple cream color bases in 
Bat Black and Hush. I don't use those very often. Oh, and I have flammable paint here as well because it's a base. Uh, this is a giant cutlery bin. Um, eyeliners. I've got a Kat Von D liquid liner here. Some cake eyeliners. Uh, my one MAC liquid last that I can't get rid of. I love it. And my four fluid lines. Dip Down, Black Track, Silver Stroke, and Macro Violet. Um, here is my like everyday stuff. My Mineralized Skin Finish Natural powder. Um, one of these is strobe cream and the other one is um, primer, face primer. Um, right now I'm mixing NC15 and NC20 together for foundation because I'm a little bit darker than NC15. And concealer. This is my foundation plate that I mix my foundation on. These are all my single MAC eyeshadows. So mineralized eyeshadows and collection ones that you can't get in the pan. Going Bananas from the Dare to Wear collection. Um, Beau Grey from the Liberty of London collection. I've got a Hello Kitty palette in here. Um, all of the style black. Mineralized eyeshadows. All MAC in here. And then back here is not MAC. I have a few Makeup Forever's eyeshadows including my all-time favorite, number 92. Um, some Urban Decay, Stilla Kitten, best eyeshadow ever. And some eyeshadows, or some Kat Von D eyeshadows in there. And then over here, all of my Kat Von D palettes. I'm only missing one, her newest one. Um, an Urban Decay eyeshadow palette that I'm not crazy about. I don't even know which one this is. But I don't ever use it. All of my MAC palettes, highlights, browns, blues and greens. This is just a mix of them. And then purples. But I take out all the dividers so that they can all just fit in there like that. Um, I have a hundred different mascaras for some reason. And then back here is primer. Urban Decay Potion Primer. Um, some Visine for mixing wet eyeshadows. And I have a color corrector here by Inglot that I don't use. And then in my last one I have eyelash curler, sharpeners, tweezers, um, an old kabuki brush, a mirror, a brush roll behind it, and some pens and markers, my fabric shears for when I'm t-shirt cutting, um, tape. So yeah, that's all my in my drawer. Close that up. My chair is from Home Outfitters. It turns around and it also has a little lever here that makes it go up. Makes it really easy for when I'm doing makeup on people. And then I've got these two organizers here. In this top one here I have all a bunch of makeup, backups and stuff. Um, hair stuff in here. And I think the other two are just junk. And then up here I have a bunch of palettes, my Sephora. I got this last Christmas. Um, Too Faced Bronzer. I love all three of these. They're awesome. And that brush is so soft and so good. So if you ever get the chance to buy this bronzing powder kit, do it. It's amazing. Um, I have a bunch of Coastal Scents palettes in here. This is my blush palette. Um, and then I have my MAC blush palette. And then I have the Coastal Scents color, um, six color contour and blush palette. I use this to contour sometimes. And underneath I have the Coastal Scents eyeshadow palette that I don't use ever. Um, eyelashes, some backups back there. Uh, lash glue, a little Benefit 
sample thing I got here. And in here I have all the foundation, some foundations and stuff, some bronzer. My Back to Mac that I'm collecting is in here. And I believe that's it. I've got a bunch of old makeup cases and stuff down here. My perfumes and all my hair stuff is over in that basket. Uh, spotlights. This is my little zebra guy that my boyfriend bought me from the zoo. I think it's carved out of wood. And my certificate's up there. And finally, my pigments. This is temporary until I get um, one of those nail polish racks that everyone buys off of eBay to put their MAC pigments in. This is just a cutlery tray that I nailed to the wall. But it works for now. I just wanted to get all my pigments up and out of the way so that I could actually see what they all were. So pigments and glitters and stuff. All my little ones. That, I hate the new packaging so much, but I haven't transferred them yet. So yeah, that's it. Um, I think that's it. Kitty. So that's my video for today. Um, Leave any comments that you want and let me know what else you want to see. Bye.